the cord and the baby, and I just called 911. I just hurried up and called. All I seen was baby and just called 911. Just shocked. I couldn't believe it. And um, scared, nervous all at the same time. And just couldn't believe it. Never seen anything like this. Here's that woman in a photo holding the baby about 30 minutes after the infant girl was left behind on Alexander Street in River Rouge. Neighbors believe home surveillance video they gave us shows mom walking away from the house around 745 Sunday morning. She looked hesitant, gazing back before eventually leaving. The video never shows her getting inside a car. Child is doing well, is at a local hospital and she's eating and check appears to be healthy. Investigators say the mother gave birth about an hour before leaving her child behind, umbilical cord still attached. The woman who found the girl did not want to be identified, but tells us the baby was in a blanket near Flowers outside an adult foster care home on Alexander near Catherine Street. That blanket was blue with cars on it. Went off the porch and looked around and just seen a baby in the blanket. And I just ran down and got the baby in. So glad that woman did the right thing. Another note, the placenta was also attached to that young baby. Investigators were going door to door today in that neighborhood, interviewing everybody, looking for any answers, but so far they're coming up empty, Carol. Uh, Aaron, did police say why the mother chose that house? Any idea? That's a very good question. They want to know that too. They want to know, did the woman actually know that was a foster care home there and maybe the people inside would take good care of that baby or did she just choose that house randomly? You saw her walk away from that house, so they believe she lives in that neighborhood or close by because she never got inside a car. Also of note, her clothing, she was wearing some dark maybe sweatpants, possibly a sweatshirt that was pink, so that could be another clue to who this woman is, Carolyn. Yeah, we're just glad that woman did not harm that baby. We've heard so many horrible stories. Thank you so much, Aaron, for the live report. Now, Michigan does have a safe haven law. It allows mothers to leave babies up to three days old with staff members at any hospital, fire station, or police station. No questions asked. Uh, Action News will continue to follow this story and bring you any new developments. Stephen.